Why do men call women gold diggers if the man is supposed to be the provider? <laughs> now, first of all, you're asking me to subjectively answer for all men, and I can't do that. But let me say this. Uh, no one wants anybody to desire them strictly for what they have. You know, um, God says, seek my face, not my hand. Yeah. And so a gold digger seeks your hand. And so that's why men say that. And uh, men are to be providers, but doesn't want a woman to be with him simply and solely because he provides. What if you have a woman who wants to live, um, and I'm saying Christian, who wants to live on a certain level financially, um, seeks out a person that has, who is a good provider and is willing to abide by the principles in the Bible of submitting to them, um, filling the role of a wife, but there's no love involved. What okay. do you think about that? Okay, well, it violates everything we've been talking about so far in terms of somebody going, just seeking out someone uh, rather than needing only the Lord. Yes. You know, so, you know, if they're going after all of this, I mean, that that's doesn't seem like a healthy uh, quest. Um, but like, once again, I say, but if you meet someone, uh, those compatibilities have to be there mm -hmm. and you make sure that you are compatible. You don't, you know, but there's a difference between being a gold digger and then having standards yeah. uh, for your, for your, yourself. Potential partner, right. Potential partner.